Well, hello everyone, my name is Pazu. Welcome to Dark Tales. Edgar Allan Poe's Messenger Sign. I believe that is German. I wonder what that means. Follow me. Follow me. So were there two evil forces at work there? Wow. What an opening. Alright, here we go, let's start the game. Messenger sign. I'm glad you could accompany me on this trip to Hungary, old friend. I've received a strange letter. So Hungary, eh? You know, I remember you. <laughs> Zawa, dear partner. Detective, I desperately need your help. Someone attacked my daughter, Frederica. The poor girl was scared to death, mumbling something about a ghost. We will await your arrival at Raven Soul Manor. We do not want this information to get out, so we are staying inside the house, not opening the door to anyone unless absolutely necessary. Mary Vaughn Messenger Sign, so that is the name and last name. Oh, good old family picture. So to go in the middle is the one in the opening movie. Please give us a signal with a burning candle when you arrive. A burning candle? Hmm, must have a good reason to ask for a special signal. So I'm supposed to wave the candle around using those hand motions. And so here we are. Well, here we are. I was told to give a signal as soon as we arrived. I brought a candle with me, but the matches are soaked. We need to find another way to light it. A soak candle. That's not good. Well, I bet there are a lot of ravens around here. It's called Raven Soul. Berlificing. So, uh, Berlificing Mansion is that way. Beyond the gate. This game has so many difficult names. <laughs> Whoa! Those crows living inside that scarecrow. <laughs> the mansion is called Ravens for a reason. Wait, are those ravens or crows? Light attack. So, we need a sequence of symbols here. Look at the blood. It's a bloody scarecrow. Anyone home? Uh, users knocking. Yeah, we need to use a candle. Plunger. It's your fault! You took him from me! Well, seems really angry. Yeah, they were having an argument. So let me guess, the father took her lover away from her. <laughs> yeah, forcefully separating the two. That's why she is so mad. Cap, step with the lighter. Locked gate. As suspected. Light, let it fall on my enemies and let my enemies burn in it. Whoa. Look at those masks. The skull mask. Like the one uh, that figure was wearing. That monster in the opening movie. He's also wearing a mask, a skull mask. Light the lantern every night. 
Why every night? Oh, look at that voodoo doll. <laughs> the bloody picture of the father. Hmm. He has enemies. Need to collect all the pieces. So we are putting back the bloody together. Get all the pieces together. What is a lighter pack anyway? A lighter pack? Do we put that inside the lighter itself? Oh. Where's that fall coming from? The purple mist again. Whoa. <laughs> right in front of us, face to face. I hope it's not a real human skeleton. That is not human, that is an animal, a pretty large one. Maybe a cow. Uh, definitely a man behind the mask. Look at those eyes. They're yeah, human eyes. Oh, and gone. <laughs> wow. But uh, at least we now have the sequence. One, two, three, four. Ah, syringe. Okay, uh, put in a plunger. Lighter gear. Are we good to go? So, lighter fluid to soak the lighter pack. Oh. This is how it works. Could use a gear. Ah, just build one. Yes, working. Yeah, I don't smoke, so I'm not familiar with how this works. <laughs> All right, let's do the hand motions. Excellent. Now that we have everything, let's light the signal candle. Good idea. So just wave it around. Select and drag the flame through the same bow. If you touch the edges of the same bow, you will have to start over again. So slow and steady. We wave through the motion all the way to the end. Perfect. Now second one, that looks like a circle. A perfect circle. Aha! So now we wait. Oh, she's signaling back. Here we go. Hello. Detective. Monsieur Dupin, welcome to my home. As I wrote in the letter, our daughter was attacked. She was reading on the terrace, and someone terrified her. Carl found her numb with fright. Please help. I'm sure it's all just a hoax. When I scared off the attacker, I heard hooves. The next morning, I went to look for the tracks, but found nothing. Perhaps you should talk to Frederica herself. She's upstairs. It's not a hoax. You sir have enemies. Uh, you know what? I think we should show him that voodoo doll with the bloody picture. Let me know if you learn anything. I'll be in my office. Right, so talk to Frederica, our next objective. Oh? Don't need to talk to him right now. <laughs> Guess he's busy. And the mom! Doing her needlework. A bookie. Uh, hmm, that looks like Caduceus in the back. So it's a first A cabinet. Music dolls. This piano. Some glass pieces in the sink. So it's like a mechanized piano. Hey, where did she go? <laughs> it disappeared. Wow. 
Oh my god! He's choking her to death. Definitely a man. A human. Okay, what do I do? I need to find something to open the door. You know what? We should go ask for help. Hey you! Your daughter is in danger. Is in mortal danger. And I don't need to talk to him right now. Are you kidding me? <laughs> wow, this is ridiculous. I guess I'm on my own. <laughs> and where's my partner? <laughs> Look at the shadow there. I am on my own. A lofty name shall have a fearful fall when, as a rider over his horse, the mortality of Messengerside shall triumph over the immortality of Berlifusane. <laughs> so Messengerside and Berlifusane. Hmm. Two family names. Uh, okay, the scissors. There's a puzzle piece. Here. Oh. Alright, let's go do that piano puzzle then. We don't have much time. Alright, complete the picture. So, like, glass piece and highlighter piece to swap it with. Now, oh, I can choose between casual mode and hard mode. But you know what, the casual mode, that's really easy. It's almost complete. Now, why don't we do the hard mode instead? It's not going to be that hard, yeah. So... Yeah, the wings are almost complete. Easy. So that part goes down. And... Uh, uh, this is the corner here. That the piece. Yeah, now this one. We almost got the top half done. Perfect. If that one, that one goes on the map. Yeah, it's going to be a mirror image. So this on the right. This is on the right. Okay, almost done. There we go, finished. So, Frederica's key, yeah, that's the one. Uh, Alright, heading into the room, all by myself. <laughs> I have no allies right now. Yeah, and the parents don't care, apparently. <laughs> I'm on my own. Here we go. Oh! Where did they go? They disappeared. Are they inside the chest? <laughs> Something very odd is going on in this house. A disappearing girl? And now, this strange fog again. Maybe there's a clue in that chest about what on earth is going on around here. Well, there's purple mist oozing out. Man, <laughs> the suspicious fog again. Let's take a picture. Oh, a code! 1435. Nice. Uh, we don't have the tumbler we was at. Well, we don't have enough. We'll come back to that. The pie poker could use a poker here right away. Wow, <laughs> how convenient! You don't get that a lot. <laughs> Finding a poker right by the fireplace—that's pretty unusual. Oh, this is scary looking. A two-headed doll, and this little head on the left has a spare eye. The third eye. Can see all the evil in this world.
Boathead. So mother and daughter's picture. It's a special key. And what's that? A coin! Bonificent coin! What is that doing here? This is not family. Use a poker. Ah! Snake's head. And another box. 